Okay, unless you have feedback on the website, you haven't looked at it. Go have a look, try the different tools, and let me know what you think. One of the more recent ones is this uh, EG2 music conversion. This is a seizure in there. We can actually hear what a seizure sounds like by scrolling through it. The auto volume probably should have been selected. So, yeah, and it will be louder when there is a seizure in the middle of those uh, 100 seconds, 100 seconds uh, of uh, data in there. And this is what seizures sounds on different channels. 10 second window of seizures. Yeah, on some channels is more annoying than others. You also have the gesture to music generator. It's a bit more annoying on one hand than the other. I'm wondering, again, I was wondering if I can swap um, swap the hands because I'm, well, whichever hand I'm using. Yeah, this sounds to me more annoying. I don't know what it sounds like to you. And yeah, it can do short notes. When you close the fingers like this and longer notes, it has two scales for each hand. That was a false detection. When my hand is behind the microphone, something else, it, uh, yeah, detecting it sometimes as the opposite hand. So it does a note from the other hand, which is not the uh, ideal. Yeah, I don't know. I really need a musician. If, if you play any musical instruments, do let me know. I can, uh, update uh, this to sound better if there is no human to talk to uh, i'll have to talk to the bot to the soulless heartless robot uh, but that's the best we've got yeah we're doing, doing some music i was thinking using it actually i'm like touching my face a lot when i when i speak so i was actually thinking using it as uh, alerting myself when i'm doing it because i'll probably well i have to re record that bit or stop doing it altogether but for now yeah especially if we're doing the web cam based eye tracking we'll need that camera i'm pretty sure open ai just uh, decreased the window uh the text what's called the token the number of tokens that you can uh, put in it's quite unfortunate because we also have the limit of uh, 40 messages per three hours. Hopefully we would not, if we do everything right, we should not hit that limit. I was thinking if I, and yes, before you scream at me for using uh, GPT-4 like this for, progr for programming, we're actually not using it for programming. We do use the uh, GitHub Copilot. Um, however, GPT-4 is much better at the general context 